All right, so we got the phaser uh, here, here on the on the vise, and you got a like a safety bolt through safety it? bolt through it. Keep okay. it it's just for safety. Okay. And uh, what we're putting in is a, it's a block out. Yeah. Uh, block out for. A yeah, it comes in that Texas Speed kit. Um, it's a block out uh, for zero degree. So we're locking this phaser out where it will not uh, move anymore. Move anymore. Right. So you got your tool here. Yep. And uh, let me give you this uh, pin. Okay. And the, the pin goes in this hole right here. Gotcha. Once I get it uh, pulled okay. over. Okay. Oh, how about right there? Mm, look at a little bit more. No, a little bit the other way. There you go. All right, now we're all the way in. Yep, pin is in. Release that. So this bolt here comes out. It's your long pin. So this one's the one you loosen but don't remove. So it's, it's the first one after that one. Clockwise down, the first one. Yeah. You'd never take this guy out. Okay. You just want to loosen him up a little bit. Okay. And take these out. Pin. Show the difference in the Yeah, so this so you got three short ones you want to have in your hand. Yeah, and one long one. One long one. Perfect. You see how I just fell there? Yeah. That's that's I call that the door. Okay, so you open the door. And then you Oh, want, you gotta take your safety off. Take the safety off. Don't mess with this a whole lot. Yeah. Take your safety off. Which is just a boat and a couple of washers. Mm-hmm. And you, you got a washer back there. There you go. You swing this door. Okay. Swing it out of the way. Yep. And he, he opens it up. All right. And you get the block. Okay. And the block only is it's only going to fit in the bottom. The bottom. Yeah. So it's probably going to be in this one. That here. one. Okay. Yeah. Now the block's got a groove on it. Some do, some don't. Okay. But if you have a groove, you want yep. to put it to the rear. And why is that? Is it is it like a it's uh well what i've come to find out you got these little holes down in here and i think all it's an all passage right if you look back up in there it's another all passage oh i see so, it. yeah i can see a hole uh, it just keeps lubricant on this block so, so so if it didn't have that groove it would block that oil passage it would okay maybe that's what they so, how, so you've done a lot of these a lot, a lot of them have grooves or a lot of them don't <laughs> I've, I've seen solid ones yeah and i've it just depends okay. you know but this is something that uh takes a speed come up with and They've been doing it for a while and they, they, know, they know what they're doing. They know what they're doing. So we're going to close the door. Close the door. I always put your pin in first in case that thing releases. It's the it, longer one. Okay. Yeah. Put that guy in there. Okay. Just to have to snug it up. Before you do too much, you put this safety back on. Oh, you're okay. Yeah. You've had one come apart one time, right? I did. Your and first I, one or something. I tried to wind it back up. It's there's a, no way. It's impossible. Impossible. I tried all kind of clamps and. There's no way. So, you got your safety back on. Got safety back on. And you snug these down. Got that guy. That's your long one. Mm hmm. You got your little short ones. Okay, what we got is 85 80, inch pounds. Inch pounds, yeah. not foot pounds, no, guys. No, not foot no. pounds. You'll, you'll snap that sucker right off of foot pounds. Okay. okay. Walk it around. Move this side. Mm -hmm. Just want to make sure every one of them gets the same amount. All right. Yep. Moving on. Now, take this guy off. Okay. Leave it. Yep. It's up against the pin. Yep. You, Done deal. And you can see it. This is the spring that he's talking about, and it rests on that pin right there. If that pin was to be gone, this spring would just oh. go crazy. Yeah. Yep. And then you take your little safety bolt back out. And it's ready for installation. And ready for installation. Mm -hmm. Well, we hope that helps a few folks that's never done it before. 
it is a little scary. Just take your time. Make sure you got the right tool. And if you want to, you can go ahead and put a mark like we did. So this is marking the pin bolt, right? Uh -huh. So then you go clockwise to your next bolt. That's the one you leave in. So your pin bolt clockwise, do not remove this bolt. No. So thanks everybody for watching. Subscribe, like, share, ring the notification bell. Have a good one. We'll see you on the next one.